Welcome back to Marathon 2. I'm Tagus. This is my wife, Erin. Hey, guys. So we are in the level, the side towards enemy. And we are unarmed because we just got rescued for, by Blake from the uh, four prison. So we kind of need to find some weapons and figure out where we are. Oh, for... We need healing. Stop throwing shit at us. Can't do it, Flicta. No. Bad Flicta. Punch in your butts. Your teeth are terrifying. This is taking a very long time. Punch you in the balls. <laughs> Save. All right, let's find out what Robert Blake wants us to know. This is a poor time for introductions, but I'm Robert Blake. I used to be a mechanical engineer on Tau Ceti, but now I'm somehow in command of the remaining human and spit survivors in this godforsaken rock. The four held you prisoner for nearly a month before we were able to discover your whereabouts and release you, but unfortunately little has changed since your capture and Durandal's destruction. I'm communicating with you through the old spit network from our base on Luan, we're barely hanging on, nearly a mile below the surface. There's a virus down here which kills four in a matter of hours. Our spits say it was bioengineered by their ancestors during the war against the four a thousand years ago. Whatever, it's saving our butts. Durandal's last instructions were for us to reactivate a dormant spit AI sealed beneath the surface and reachable only through teleportation. We hope you will succeed where we failed. Good luck. All right. How do we get there? Um. What does this even do? I don't know. That's a very good question. Hi. Where do we go? Flick does. Quit it. I don't know where anything is. It's really dark in this water. They're very camouflagey. Especially since this is a water flicked up. <laughs> oh god. This takes so painfully long. And we don't even get a weapon that fires underwater until Marathon 3. It'd be way too helpful. On the upside, we have health. Healing! Yay! Thank you Why? for the ammo. Why would you drop ammo underwater? Because we're gonna be underwater. Um. Oh. <gasps> That's where we came from. Oh. I don't understand what it does. I feel like... Oh, that needs to go up so we can cross it later. Okay. Alright, let's take an arrow path. Where do we go? I'm assuming this must be... I hear... Oh, right there. I was like, I hear a thingy right here. Oh dear. Thingy, come up out of the water. Yay! Riding into freedom! Um. Which way do I go? You'd think they would have given us some weapons. We like, have these delightful brass knuckles. <sighs> Ow. Punch in the flick does. Forever. And ever.
<laughs> oh, that was fun. Okay. Um. <gasps> no. Come back, lifter. Okay. Here we go. Oh, oh my god, why? The developers of this game are masochists. Or the sadists. Sadists. Oh, Lori. Also, why are the footprints coming in threes? Just to irritate you, because they take so freaking long to kill. Really, all one would have to do is go like, Whoa. and then we'd be dead. Yeah. They just stand there getting punched to death. Oh no! No. Oh, the flick does. Oh, gun! Yay! I have a gun. Now we can shoot the flick does instead of punching them. Um, let's try going back. So if we can only reach this place by teleportation, why don't they just teleport us? They did. Oh. That's where we are right now. Okay. Um. But there's open sky. Oh, yeah. Um. Two guns! Oh, come on. Ugh. Why? There are entirely too many hostile aliens on this planet. Ow! Oh no, oh no, oh no. I'm going to die, I'm going to die. Nope, nope, nope. Can we just run away? Oh! I am totally going to die. Can't we go get some healing somewhere? Yeah. Anywhere? Here's a question. Oh. Oh no. Oh no. Get out here! Get out! Get out! Get out! All right. <laughs> Good job. We need to heal, rather desperately. Get rockets. That doesn't seem fair. Remind me what we're trying to do. Turn on the old um, uh, Spit AI. All right. Which I think might be these green things. How do we do that, though? We're flying! I'm guessing... Oh, for the love of God. Are we lost? Oh no, oh no, oh no. Okay. 
We're not lost, we're just... Fuck. We're just ah! Oh, yeah. Oh, God. What's happening with- oh, oxygen. Ah! Mother fucker. I'm almost tempted to use the uh, cheat to give us un unlimited, um, ah! unlimited, uh, not unlimited, sorry. I'm almost tempted to use the cheat to give us better weapons. I wouldn't ah! Okay. Cheat away, cause I'm tired of getting killed in one shot. Woo! Super health! We should get more oxygen. Um... Yeah, cause I don't think we were going to make it through this without... Although I feel... I feel kinda bad that, you know, like, we're taking basically taking a shortcut. You're doing well, but have not activated all the personality cells in this area. We've been able to find no maps of this structure to help you, but the activation switches must be nearby. Drandall convinced us that this old computer is our only link to the Lost Fit clan, and that bringing back the Lost clan to fight against the Four was our only chance of stalling their invasion of Seoul. Nobody here wants to think about what would happen if the Four reached Earth. Terrible, horrible things would happen. I like how he's basically just sitting with his arms behind his back and he's like yeah well they're all hiding so you're the only one who's out and about doing stuff um um what's happening why is everything silent The sweater being battled by the Flicta. Works for me. Okay, we're ready to depart. Um, I'm just gonna wait till. I don't think anything's coming this way. Okay, let's do this. Good work. The Sfit have verified the partial activation of the e AI. The four are already curious about what we are doing, <clears throat> but when they realize. Oh. Sorry, I thought he was coming this way. What we have found, they will go insane. We'll continue trying to replace the weapons you lost when you were captured, but all the heavy ordnance is in high demand, and it may be a few hours before a rocket launcher or flamethrower is available. I already fixed for that. Man. The rest of the AI will have to wait, though. Our base has been infiltrated by four androids. The machines are disguised as humans and packed with explosives. Aside from detonating them, we got no way of telling them apart from our own men. Their telltale differences are hard to spot until it's too late. We missed you. We need you to come back and exterminate these sim simulacrums. Yeah. No one will be safe until they are all dead. So, um... How do we tell who's who? It's really hard. For example... He's definitely not a simulacrum. Oops. If you were the one I was trying to destroy. Okay. Tell me how to tell, so I can be helpful. Um, they'll either scream and say something really weird, or they'll just follow us. Oh. For example, I'm out of ammo. I'm out of ammo is something that the real humans will not say. And they have to be green. So if they're green and they say, or if they say something weird like "Frog Blast Event Core," they're bad. All right. Return to this terminal when you have detonated all the assimilated humans you can find. Remember, they look just like our guys, but their minds don't work like ours. Sometimes they give themselves away by saying something a real person wouldn't. Watch out for friendly fire and good luck. You mean like the guy I already killed? Yeah. Well. I guess we might as well use all of the weapons available to us, right? Yeah. Are you ready? Yes. Yeah. 
that was definitely a simulacrum. I'm going to... I just want to lure them all into a hallway because the evil ones... The evil ones will immediately come for us. Their little scream when they burst into flame entertains me a little bit. Are you evil? Tell me by running towards me. I should just kill everyone. Wouldn't that be bad? Don't they need the other people? Yeah, but the mission, it won't, it's not like the mission will end. That's true. But they will all shoot us. Also, there are four on the base right now. Where? Um, you'll see in a minute. In a minute. Oh boy. Yeah, so they act like they're insane. Works for me. Their ceiling and floor are desert. -y. <laughs> I'm going to assume that they're, uh, Running crazy prey is not people. <laughs> All right, now. Oh dear. Yeah. Don't shoot. Oh, I guess I could just shoot them because I, I mostly want them to fight for me. Oh. oh. Did you see it explode? Yep. So you just need like one tiny shot from these ones because they have the yellow blood. That's true. <laughs> that was very, uh... Have fun with that. See ya. Oh. oh, sorry. Did you shoot at people? Yeah, he's like, cut it out. Okay, that's good. So they've got the basement secure. Any more peeps we have to shoot? Yeah, there's lots more. Oh. I'm out of ammo. They're very explody. <laughs> oh, you shot at people again. Don't worry, the uh, the four got him. Get out of my way. I'm gonna shoot you. Dude, move. Uh oh dear. That was the very. No, no. That. Ah. Oh, ho, ho. Killing all the people. Oh, oh dear. Oh dear. Ah. You died. Maybe I should just kill everyone. Well, it couldn't hurt. All right, killing all everyone is green. Kill all humans. Ah. Except now they all want to kill us. Hey, nothing they can do about it anyways. We are so oh, murdering. They're like, God, he's nuts. Did you hear that? Faster when we just have a flamethrower, everybody. We're gonna run out of flamethrower, though. 
Yeah, I've got lots. I got lots of other stuff. You're out. No, I'm not. We might still die. Um... There. Ow. Oh. <laughs> no, we're killing everybody. Oh, you know what? There's an even better way of doing this. Um, although first, I think I'm gonna go heal. Healing is good. Because we're almost dead. Yes. Where is the healing terminal? Back at the start here. That's only a red one. Yeah, but better than nothing. This is true. There's like one guy alive over there. Oh. How did I miss you? Maybe he was hiding. Some of them are sneaky sneaks. That's a little hazardous down there. Yeah. Maybe save the flamethrower for when there's a whole bunch of them. Okay. I like the guys up there. Remember, because we we killed all of them. All right. Yeah, they they. Uh, Priorities, people. Yeah, they're they're targeting ah. us because we're uh, hostile now. So I'm basically massacring all of Blake's men. Yeah, I'm sure he won't enjoy that. Okay, I think I got the simulacrums down here. Okay, we might be we might be done now. Healing. <laughs> Good work. Durandal gave the name Thoth to the uh, ancient personality construct we were trying to activate. Someone here said the Thoth was the ancient Egyptian god of wisdom, with a human body and the head of an ibis. We reviewed all the information Durandal left us about Thoth, but nowhere have we been able to discover what to do after the AI is fully operational. I believe that Durandal expected Thoth to contact the Lost Clan. I should tell you that there are many that many of us here see Durandal's destruction as a good thing. Even if we're stuck on an alien world in the galactic core, at least we're in control of our own destinies again. Frankly, nobody liked the way Durandal carelessly threw us into battle, heedless of the risk to our lives. Trust me, I'm not a Thor lover, but with Durandal no longer pulling the strings, a great weight has been lifted from our shoulders. We're planning to steal a Thor ship of our own to return to Earth. You're invited to come with us when we do. Disregarding everything that just happened. Yep. So, I think, uh... We did complete the mission, so... True. I did, so now we're in my own private thermal palais. I think. I don't know how you pronounce it. Thermopylae? Thermopylae. I don't know these things. So, 
we're my own private Thermopylae. Uh, hope you guys enjoyed that and our uh, wanton destruction of the human base there. <laughs> yeah, we'll just slaughter all the digital people. If you enjoyed it, give us a like and subscribe, and thanks for watching. Bye, guys!